Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Shark. Y'all know what time it is. Hit the like button, turn the notification on, and subscribe to the channel because I promise you, you won't be disappointed. Listen, y'all make it do what I do, what I do, what I do. And remember to speak when you walk on in the chat because ain't nobody sleep with you last night. If you aren't following me on any forms of social media, go ahead and follow me at TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and X, even on Patreon at Shark's Reality Number Six. If you haven't had a chance to follow my backup page, please do at Shards Reality Family. Hello to everybody. Newcomers, flip floppers in day ones. What's up, Lottie Dottie, everybody? Let's jump into it. Let's jump into it. So we talked about a little bit about this earlier, but we didn't get into the full details. So here we are to sum it up. Guys, know that Melanie's been talking about her trip to LA that's coming up and how she scored big with TikTok. And just a reminder, let's talk about what she said before we get to Cal. Okay. Okay. So remember she had to say everything God is doing is just so amazing. So let me fill you all in. Remember a month ago I was challenged and you all helped me. It says we created a new TikTok creators page. It says because of my GMV on 7th Avenue beauty page, which means, which means the sales are selling. Okay. And all the hard work we've been doing, uh, we were offered opportunity to be signed. Dawn and I were just in all and still are at how God was moving. Now in only a month, we've been literally been invited out to host a TikTok live in Los Angeles, California. It goes on to say we will be getting support like none other for the sponsored live i'm still in disbelief the most beautiful thing of it all is that when they asked me on last friday if they could fly me out next weekend i remembered i had the kids but just before she mentioned the kids she said that she will be i guess sponsored by or represent or managed by one of the top tiktok agencies that manages uh, the person that hit 1.6 million in sales on one single live. And people kind of, you know, took that like that was stormy and it had to be Cal. Okay. And like I said earlier on the live, I knew it was not Cal because she said manages, which means that it is happening now. And Stormy and Cal has split a while back. Okay. And I also said that I don't think that she would have crossed path like that. It's nothing against Cal and it's nothing against Stormy, I'm sure. But I don't think that she would have. Melanie likes to make a name for herself and she likes to show uh, God as being the author of it all. So I don't think that she would have mix stormy cow and all of that glory okay i just don't think so so that was my own thoughts on it however cow must have got wind that people were associating him with this uh so he has responded and i i can appreciate it right that kills all the assumptions that kills all of the gossiping that kills all of the curiosity okay he clears the air and this is what he has to say all right let's listen he says hi friends just wanted to clarify i am not and partnership with Mel. I wish her and the team the best of luck and what sounds like a very exciting step for their business. He says it looks like they're doing well on their own. He says the amount of units for all products sold on TikTok is public information. Feel free to sleuth like I do. Okay, I believe the $1.6 million record holder in question is someone named Mandy, who is absolutely crushing it on TikTok. Okay, so he clarified it's not him that's working side by side with Melody. Uh, he wish her and her team the best. He also says on her home, <laughs> as in Stormy did not do it on her own he had to come in and save her um and he also says that no it's not stormy y'all giving her too much credit the person that's really doing her big one is miss mandy whoever that is okay so y'all drop down in the comment section let me know what you guys think about cow clear in the air it's not me but good luck to you mel uh and meet me in the comment section until next time checkmates i love you and it ain't nothing you could do about it and don't you let nobody tell you nothing different bye